Hello there. So I got this metal fidget slider of the holidays, and the other day I was messing around with it, and I thought to myself, you know, I bet I could 3D print a fidget toy like this. It doesn't seem that complicated. So let's make it. Okay, so my goal in this episode is just to get the base sliding mechanism designed and 3D printable. If that goes well, in the future, I'm planning to make other versions that incorporate magnets or other indexing features to make the sliding action more snappy, like the metal one that it's based on. But for right now, all I'm focusing on is making the base sliding mechanism. I want it to print in place, already assembled, without any supports. If you want to try printing it yourself, you can get the model for free on my things.com profile. The link for that's down in the description. I also have affiliate links in the description for the material that I used as well as all of the 3D printing hardware that I use in case you want to try any of it out for yourself and help support the channel in the process. Now without further ado, sit back, relax, and enjoy some chill lo-fi while we watch me stumble through modeling this thing in Fusion 360.
I'm honestly a little shocked and pleasantly surprised to be able to say that this thing printed out perfectly on the first try. The tolerances are just right. It slides freely but isn't too loose. I printed it using a brim since the ends are so small. I was a little concerned about it sticking to the build plate well, but with the brim it stuck down perfectly. Once the brim was removed it snapped open and slid easily. It's definitely less satisfying than the metal one with the magnets, but it's definitely still fun to play with. I'd say it's successful enough to explore the idea more and make other versions, so if you are interested in seeing that, be sure to subscribe. If you want to see the full, unedited, real-time process for designing this model, including me rambling to myself, I've uploaded that under Design Sessions. Uh, a link to that video is in the description below. But if you liked the video, hit the like button. If you didn't like the video, hit the dislike button. Either way, tell me what you think in the comments below. If you want to see more videos like this, then subscribe. You know how YouTube works. Stay moxious.